welcome to another episode. So today I have this 52 inch Samsung television here. Um, it doesn't power on, the relay switches inside just click on and off constantly. Um, the power light will blink, we'll get no picture. So I have a feeling it's something to do with the power supply. So let's crack it open and see what we can find inside this big boy. Let's get to it. Okay, so we got the back off this thing and I instantly found the problem here. It was pretty visible. I'm just gonna pan up a little bit and see if you can spot this. And there they are. There are two bad capacitors on the main power supply. And I will zoom in for you. Right there. So those two bulge caps with the um, contents leaking out, those have burst. And the other capacitors, I did a quick look through on this thing and that seems to be the only culprits visibly damaged. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull off this power supply and then we will replace those two capacitors and test the TV again. So uh, let's get this board on the bench and get those replaced. Okay, so that's where the bad capacitors were, were sitting in these two slots here. These blown guys. So we're going to replace those. By the way, these are um, 820 microfarad capacitors rated at 25 volts. I'm going to be replacing them with uh, 1,000 1000 microfarad capacitors at 25 volts. It'll give it a little more capacity, it won't hurt, and hopefully some more mileage. So let's get those popped in there. Okay, so we're all wired back up. We got the AC power in. We have our mains for our uh, backlight and the control panel power. We have our replaced capacitors up here. And those two at the top that are side by side. Those guys. Uh, those are now 1000 microfarad capacitors as opposed to 820s. But they're the same voltage rating, 25 volts each. That should be sufficient to uh, get this power supply going unless there's something else that's wrong with it. So. Um, I'm going to get this TV turned around and give it a test run and we'll see if it comes on for us. Let's get to it. Okay, so we have all this capacitor junk installed, so let's uh, plug it in and see if we get anything on the screen here. Now for the moment of truth, will we get power? It looks like we have a tone, and I believe the TV should come on if everything goes according to plan. So there you have it. We've repaired the 52 inch. So it looks like the only issue we were having were the uh, two capacitors on the main power supply board that we replaced. And um, now that this TV is back in service, uh, customer should be happy, so I'll put the remaining screws in and uh, deliver this back to the owner. So I hope you like this video. Give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and let me know if you like the shorter versions of these repair videos, or would you like me to go into more detail like I've been. Um, let me know in the comments below, and until next time, we'll see you later.